हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज आकाश पटेल वेलकम टू द एक्सको ट्यूटोरियल टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू दैट हाउ कैन यू अप्लाई अ ड्रैगिंग लॉजिक टू योर यू एलिमेंट व्हेन यू आर ड्रैगिंग एनी बटन और व्यू और एनी इमेज व्यू यू नीड टू ऐड अ ड्रैगिंग लॉजिक हियर सो लेट्स गो फॉर इट जस्ट नेम योर प्रोजेक्ट you can use ui image or ui button any ui element you can use i am going to use a view to easiness so just set up frame i am applying a square frame you can use the frame according to your need to little bit nice look and feel i'm going to uh, round my view so first of all let's create a outlet for it okay and name it my view in view did lo method my view dot layer dot corner radius is equal to set dot my view dot frame this will set the round uh, per round of from the square view the corner radius is to half of your height or width because that just that the view is a square and to affect of uh, to apply this code we need to add one more line here yes it's a mask to bounds and this is a boolean value that indicates the uh, that your sub view which is a uh, in our case it's a my view that my view is clipped to the layers mount or not so we are going to provide a boolean value true here and if you need to check just run the project yes you can see that the view is round okay so now just apply the dragging logic here we are going to use a pan gesture here because there is a two way uh, you can use the touches begun method as well as you can use a pan gesture but in case of touches begun uh, it will fire every time when you touch on the screen and here we need to fire the particular dragging logic method only when user touches on the ui element the, whether it is a ui image or ui view so just create one pen gesture okay and initialize our pen gesture here the target is yourself and the selector i hope it's not disturbing because the background sound is disturbing me but i hope it's okay now just define a function with the same name now just apply the latest law apply the latest frame of when you drag a view or ui element then the frame is changing according to your view and so that particular new frame you have to initialize with the latest frame now let's go for it now just create a new point first and pen gesture will uh, is providing one functionality location in view it is provide the lit latest x and y coordinates of the touch here we are going to use the self dot view and set a latest frame
okay now set the x and y coordinate with the new point so it will change the frame and the width and height will be remain same so just take a older width and height okay and now just change the old frame with the new frame so wherever you your view uh, recognize the pen gesture on it then this method will fire and it applies the latest frame to your view now uh, before starting we need to add a gesture recognizer to our particular view so just take the add gesture recognizer method and pass our pen gesture here yes so now just run the project you can see that our view and when I am dragging it yes here outside of the view it's not take there is no effect of the drag outside of the view but when we drag inside of the view then it will drag the view so that's all from my side thank you so much for watching my video if you like then hit the like button and if you have any query related to this then please comment thank you so much guys have a nice day